Beautiful, brother. Beautiful. Okay, so what did we do last time? Uh, and let's see Ropi GG's. We kinda went... Ah, oh, wait, no, no, no. This is for the, for the other case. Ah, mine is there too, but... Okay, okay, okay. Uh, oh yeah, so this is the team, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. We, which one is yours? One second. Papa Kappa, oh, 93. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Okay, let's see. So last session, Odi, do you remember what we did? Yeah, you basically learned me the basics of ADC. <laughs> We have essentially talked for wave management, management a lot, and what how I should do in laning phase. That's okay. what we did. We didn't go to other shit because that was too bad, and okay. that was the first thing we had to, to fix. So we said wave management, champions limits on Ezreal, laning phase, matchups, how yeah. we're playing the matchup. Okay, okay. And we said wave management is the biggest thing. Yeah. Hmm, I see. Okay, so we said build the three champions pool, and we did we decide what champs we play? Um, not really. You basically let me experiment, play my games, and see what works. So I dropped Ezreal. Okay. For now, I went. If you see my OPGG, I think it's pretty obvious. Raya is the one. Okay. Okay. Yes. Um, yes. the other it is probably. I used to play Kate a lot, but she kinda, I don't know, she got nerfed a bit and I was like, and it wasn't the best against the Kate supports when you are with randoms. So I dropped it and I'm with some Mira and I've been playing some Jinx lately as well. Okay, so the champion pool is Zaya? Zaya, some Mira, Jinx, I would say. I think okay. that's the goal. Okay, and, Zaya, some Mira, I mean, Jinx. <laughs> I don't know, Varus is also in the picture. That sounds I think very I good. That sounds very good. I think I prefer the others. Okay, so right now you're diamond. So your uh, goal is to ma to become a master tier, right? But you were basically one trick pony Zaya. I would say I played a lot of games with Zaya, fix my wave management, let's say. I see. Um, but I did not like when I climbed. I from D4 to D3, I played other shit as well. But yeah, I would say Zaya is the most played for sure. I see. I see. I see. I see. I see. Okay, so for today. Should we do... Uh, do you think you have a good game to review or should we just play a live game again? What, what do you think is best for you? Um, let's play a live game and a we live can see game? after. Okay. Yeah, that and good. we so can then. see... We can see after for... Uh... Okay, so what exactly in the wave management department you, you did bad? Do you remember? First one was I didn't freeze the wave. Uh, I didn't... I didn't manipulate the wave in order to get the advantage my champion needed. For example, when we were playing in gate support, I didn't freeze it enough in our part of the lane, or I didn't uh, push it in order to bounce back. I see. I didn't get good reset timers. Oh shit! Okay, so that's a big one. So it's yeah, fundamentals. Had fundamentals. Had... Okay. Yeah, it was fundamentals. It was literally <laughs> fundamentals. Uh, do you still see my screen? No. Okay, one second. Mm, so no. you have I... some games on Zaya where the summoner spell is a bit off. But with trash in that situation, I think it's just better to get healed. Plus, X, like uh, cleanse against Milo is like not good. I mean, okay. You can cleanse the root of the Zaya, but just take no. It's on mostly that. it's mostly for the Ramos. I for guess, the Ramos, I see. Ramos, I but yeah. you I have a trash and you have your champers, so but yeah. it, it 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 could be good. Yeah, cleanse if you're comfortable with cleanse. There is not that bad. No, but at the same time, I don't really like getting cleansed for only one thing. Yeah, yeah. It depends what kind of the target is, because if they have Elise, it's always always must to get cleanse, because Elise is such a powerful early game champion that. You yeah. can dodge the cocoon with a name on Lady Kerry. Yeah, so summoner spell usage is uh, quite important because you really want to take your summoner spell based on what you, what you want to do in the lane. Like if you want to play super safe and it's a safe matchup, yes, ghost. Uh, otherwise, heal, cleanse, or exhaust, depending on what you need in the lane. And of course, if there is something huge target in the late game that you want to like play around, you can also go the summoner spell for the late game. But I recommend you to take the summoner spell for the early more. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it's all it makes sense. It's all of you. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Can I? Uh, well, you, <laughs> you don't like Rogas? <laughs> um. Let's say I've played him a bit, and I've seen some shit. Oh, you played him? Yeah. Oh, okay. I used to be a big Gragas player. I used to jungle, so Gragas, Jarvan, and I, I think see. it's disgusting that he hasn't been nerfed yet. Definitely like, not a bad jump. Or here. Any, <laughs> or yeah, any support, yeah. Well, now I can't pick Samira into this, so I kinda have to go Zaya. Well, you, you can't go Zaya here into Jinx Lulu for sure. 
and Samera with any is very Samira bad. Is banned. Yeah, it's banned anyways. So what other option do you have? You can go Zaya if you're Jin. comfortable. Jin. Or Jin, Jin. Jin, anything that you're comfortable with. Like usually picking Samara here is like <laughs> polymorph oh. first of all. Samara if if he was open. Yeah 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 I can't say the plus that's any like Yeah and it's Samara any like you can pick Samara. Ooh. It's gonna be a nice matchup who con who con Grenegon. Hey <laughs> going to be fun indeed. And let me remember. It was Gale Force into Infinite. Yes, yes. Jin. <sighs> Even Rapid can be good, but Infinity is in majority of the cases better. It's Infinity second, Rapid third. It's kind of like this, most most of the cases. But we can also go Blatters third if you really want it. The thing is, I don't think so against a Wukong and against a Jinx. It just feels like you need range. So probably Gale Force Infinity, the Rapid Fire Cannon, and then either Lord Dominix or BT. This is basically the build here, I think. Yeah, you need range for sure. Rapid Fire Cannon 30 is must. Mm -hmm. Exhaust is yeah. super shit here against Jinx oh, Lulu, no, no. so okay. heal, heal uh, is his best. Try to play with the Andy. Like, I can't do much myself. I either have to set her up, like hit a QW and she stuns, mm -hmm. or I have to play with her stun. Okay. But uh, Jinx has cleanse, and there is Lulu as well. Like, if we walk up a bit more than we should, we get run down. Yeah, well, I mean, Jinx is weaker than Jin early game, first of all, so you can always out-trade. If you just have crit and you trade with Q, she will never out-trade you, unless you're like in the minions or something crazy. Uh, you should always win early game, in this case. And then later on, it's hard, but you have the Vi. Vi is good into Jinx. The thing is, they have Kale, Jinx and Lulu, so they don't have a bad comp, yeah, they have a much better comp. So this trifecta is... You need I to mean, win the, the lane. Is better. You need to win the lane, because if you don't win the lane, it's going to be very difficult. So you need to get priority, because without prior you can't do anything in this lane. And after you get prior you need to play for zoning with the crit. Yeah. So that's basically the game plan right here. We need to win as much as, as, as possible the lane, because late game is very, very difficult. We have... The only thing that we have better in late game is split push. We all... Like Fiora always wins split push, but other than that... We're fucked. After 26 <laughs> yeah. minutes, you Jin is very weak champion late game as well in the enemy composition. Like Wukong. Wait, wait, you think in Zen? Ah, I mean, into this comp. Into yeah. into tanks and tanky people in general. And they have Jinx and, and Gale. they have Jinx yeah. and Lulu. So it's even if they yeah, have uh, Kale, they are like. I cannot so. force shot someone. Yes, yes, yes. These two. Yeah. Well, pretty shit game, but that's going to be interesting at least. Yeah, let's see if you improve your wave management. That's the most important thing. Yeah, yeah. I would love here to go. I wouldn't mind here passing bots, but... Yeah. I don't really want to help a lot so I can get prior. Yeah, you can get prior either way. If you just start queuing the minions, mm, Jin will yeah, always get prior. She can also queue. Oh, yes, sure. yes. Usually you can also drop Q because it's only four, 40 mana and it's gonna regenerate as you go the lane. Fuck me, that was messy. Well, now technically I have to push. Yes. But, and Wukong was. Need to push really hard. Good Q. Good W. Good E. And then finish the minions up with the Q. That's very good. That was very good the way you pushed right here with the E first, W, and then you just blow the minions up with the Q. It's very nice. Ah, thank Be you very that. careful when you. Space. So you're leaving base with 680 HP. That's very, very bad, right? Because now, look how much health per, per second you, you've you got. You've got yeah, one but per guess second. With the fleet, I get healed, like, till I get there, right? Plus, it's pushing to me. Sure. Yeah, but it's 30 heal, right? With the. Okay. So you're missing a hundred gold, a hundred HP more, more than that. Be very, very careful when you do this. Let's try. Oh, it didn't get stunned. Need to freeze here. Don't queue, please. It's gonna be very bad if you queue. We might get ganked here by Kong, so we just need to zone and make sure we don't really die here. Very good zoning. Very good zoning. Very good zoning. Very good zoning. 
Very, very good. Very well played here. Well, now I see the Vi starting Dragon, but I fear that if I push... So you just have to F key first to see what, what's going on there. It's bad. Yeah. <clears throat> she can queue over the wall, so you don't need to like crush the wave. But there is a rule of thumb, you need to like always uh, look at the Vi to see if she needs your help. And if she needs your help, you can always like stay. And uh, and push the wave, but in that situation she didn't really need your help as you can kill over the wall. That's good that he didn't follow overall. Okay. You can't escort the wave here because if you do they're gonna stop you after. They're gonna have a free easy release or release. That sucks, but it's okay, we go on the replay on that. I guess I should have pushed to help the Vi. But I wasn't sure if the Wukong was there. Ah, no. I go on the replay, no worries. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't know what is Wukong right here. To just push this really hard, kill the minions and then push it. Yeah, we need to do it very, very fast. Close. Wukong is here for sure. Very obvious. Nice heal. Should not flash there, he's in level 6. Go on the replay on that, it's very obvious gank. That we're gonna get. Since they walked up like that. Good that we stopped him. Get the minions here, maybe it can bounce on them. Should kill the minions here. Oh, that was a bad angle Q. Can get the plate and the recall here, let's see if we do it. It's very, very bad, very bad. Don't know where is Wukong flipping a coin. Executed. Good. Very good wave management right here to keep to get to keep the wave like this. It's yeah. coming into you <laughs> and you don't have any additional extra item if you stay and push one more. As you can see you have perfect buy. Did you know where is Wukong there when you kill Lulu in the tower? If there was if he was around here? Yes, did you know where he is? Or did he just make um, a play coin flip? Wait, he was he was bot? And I knew he is probably passing top because he finished that. So he coin and flipped, right? the play. Yeah, but at the same time, Jinx wasn't there, no? And he didn't have R when I saw him. I don't know. Maybe it was a bit of a coin flip, yes. Wukong missing. Mm -hmm. Wukong is missing. Mm, yeah, but he was probably hovering the top shell, no? Well, he could because be he could anywhere. Watch. Now there's a... Be very careful with these assumptions. You see that you're, you you yeah. can always be wrong, right? You can stay and push right here. Yeah, but the next one is also... Uh... It's not a cannon. Okay, and you can insta pop the wave. So it also depends on like how many items you have because now you have with pickaxe don't quiver, no matter how what kind of minion it is, you just one shot it. So be very very careful with the assumptions that you're making with the jungle because you're going to coin flip a lot. So if you don't know where he is, you should assume that he's bot lane unless you see him otherwise. Because no matter where he should be, he's never gonna be where he should be. He's always gonna be opposite. It's solo queue and yeah. people can do crazy stuff. Yeah. So far it's very good. 
We are ahead in this composition. We have to be. Um, I think I crash. Uh, although I don't know where three, two of them are. Ah, Luli stop. But I don't know where Wukong is again. Very good push, let's pressure. I think we can dive here, honestly. Yes, be careful, Wukong, and that's all. Yeah, I mean, that's, I guess, the problem. But... Very good pressure, Adi. Very, very good. Lulu is top lane, so you can hard, like, yeah, hard yeah. push always. And you can also, like, stay in the brush and then ulti the jinx to chunk her just to chunk her because if you dive and Wukong is there you die but if you just ulti uh, yeah. she just backs off very good beautiful brother beautiful Okay, so technically I get tower. I know. Yeah, I don't know where. And then I get mid, right? I go mid. Right now you get BF sword, and since your bot wave is and fully pushed, then you can come. I have. This. Uh, I also have this. You're super strong right now. Yeah, oh fuck! Wait. I should have dropped a ward as well. What's the CS advantage on board? Pretty significant, that's good. That's ah, good. do you see this bug? It's has been happening a lot to me lately. Oh, what bug, what bug? 134. Look, on the tab it's 132, here it's 134. Uh, I don't sure. see your cursor. What do you mean? Uh, look, look on top right, my farm and on the tab. Oh, really? Yeah. It's very I don't know, it's... Oh. Very good follow up you did. Mm, maybe I should have. Uh, I think it was greedy getting the getting the cannon. It yeah. cost it. It may have cost it. Yeah, but it's the cannon. It's worth to stay for it. Mm. It's like seventy gold. It's pretty huge. Wukong, careful. Ah, this is huge. Mid tower as well. Yeah. You need to get bot to collect the wave. The wave is one important, by the way. You think? Yeah. And because look at that juicy wave. This is like a kill. Then we can join, perfect rotations, perfect decision making right here already. Oh, okay. Well, not. Of Gale push for the arena. I have lost the game here, by the way. <sighs> because they have so much better composition, so it's gonna be difficult to play. Well, I get... oh. 
Well, that sucks. But... You have it if you sell your potion, by the way. Mm, yeah, I mean, it's worth it, uh, but... Right now, you're not gonna be able to yeah, record too soon. Well, this dragon sucks that was lost, but it's not over. I'm fed. I can get rapid as well. What? Wait, what? So you can't pop the vital if she ults? Well, that's new. Wait, no. I shouldn't have ulted there. Yeah, we were a bit too close to them. We should only ulti when we don't have range for the ult attack. Yeah. And it's like unsafe. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have ulted and I gave what? Wait, I didn't have a bounty? What? That's far behind? Um, didn't you? I didn't give a bounty. That's new. That's very interesting. That's. I mean, that's good. Who got you? The Wukong, right? Yeah, but. But I think he did. But it doesn't say anything here, no? It should say it's in. Yeah, okay, yes. it doesn't say anything. I don't know. It's pretty buggy. No, no. We have great big potential, but. We have some pretty negative shit in this guy, so. I think after rapid fire cannon we can still win. Ah uh, yeah, but these are slowly coming online. So plus I'm seeing some weird shit. Yeah. And I walked up like an idiot, and now it's probably... Now it's gonna be pretty bottom. difficult to play. Yeah, now it's bottom, so... Okay, we have tippers. Do we have flash tippers? No, uh, they cannot win. Well, they can start to steal. Oh, oh shit. No way. I think it's still winnable, but they have to troll. Yeah, it's not on our hands, but it's definitely winnable because we have damage. This is huge, you know, flash. Yeah, yeah, and we have this in a bit, so... Actually, if we get solved, this is... This is... The best. I should have saved traps. And yeah, we should be cool. Fuck, I missed the Wukong. 
Yes, okay. Baron is up, this is actually pretty huge. Yeah, 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 I'm not even, I'm not even. GG well played. I don't think it's over. They but now we have to game. fuck up Bruges. <clears throat> It's Lord, right? Lord Doms. Yeah, they have played at boost, right? BT would be another option. G can be decent, but I think Lord Dom oh, is best. Think G. Yeah, G is very bad. It's either if I die, it's over anyway. So let's go for this. Ren, if I can pop them, it's it's worth. Now we have to wait for Hyora, in my opinion, to, try, uh, to attract one guy and then we'll lean someone, the Kale, probably. The Lucian is at a point where he does a lot of damage. So. Ah, fuck. Close. I can pop. But... Yeah, it's just... Okay. Fucking solo, man. Fucking no solo. way. No way you win this game. Like... Yeah, no way I win this game like this. Because <clears throat> the early game was promising. Like, the early game was... When <sighs> does it stop when... For, for, in order for us to win. But then they choked. Yeah, they had their g this game. They had it in their hands. They just threw. Yeah, classic shit. Yikes, man. Yep. Just yikesy. Okay, let's go on the on the replay. What do you uh, think you did wrong here? 